Hey guys, it's uh, Squirtle Squad 444 here, and today I'll be covering the newest Pokemon Sun and Moon trailer. There's a lot of news to cover today, and I'm kind of hyped about it. So now, let's get into this. So first, we have a new Pokemon named Type Null. I'm not completely sure if that's the final name, or if there's another form to it, but I know that it's a normal type, and that it knows Tri-Attack, or some move similar to that, in the battle picture. Next, we have a new Pokemon named Jangmu. I find it a little bit interesting for Pokemon to announce a new Dragon type, but in my opinion, I think Dragon types are kind of cool. And also, I think that Jangmu might have an evolution, meaning that it's sort of a small Pokemon. Moving on, we have a new Alolan form. It's Raticate. This is a slightly chunkier version of the regular Raticate, but it's dark and normal type just like a Lolan Rattat. After that, we have something cool that's going to be added into Pokemon Sun and Moon. Pokemon wants the games to be 12 hours apart from each other, so I'm guessing if you have your time on your 3DS set to 9pm and you have Sun, it'll be night, but maybe if you have Moon and it's 9pm, it'll be day, or maybe it'll only be two game exclusive cutscenes. We'll see when they announce more news about it. Next, we have new people in the game, the Aether Foundation. They kind of remind me of the Devon Corporation in Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. It also looks like they are made up of five people. Their names are Lusamine, Faba, Wiki, and the two employees that don't have a name. I guess they rescue Pokemon or something, because that's what Wiki does. Also announced is the new Team Skull Enforcer. His name is Gladion. In the Alolan region, you could find and collect cells and cores. I think this has something to do with Zygarde forms somehow. Like the 100%, the 75%, the 25%, the 50%. Next, and probably the coolest feature in Pokemon Sun and Moon, is the Poke Finder. It allows you to go to certain places and take pictures of Pokemon nearby. You could save them in your game gallery, or maybe even your 3DS game gallery, maybe later on if they know to. I'm assuming you could take pictures of rare Pokemon, like this Dragonite depicted on screen. And lastly, we have a new type of Pokemon announced, Ultra Beast. The specific one named UB01, we know nothing about except its design. So yeah, there's a lot of new news today. And if you enjoyed, I would appreciate it if you gave this video a like. And yes, we did reach 35 subscribers. It's a pretty cool milestone, I have to admit. So yeah, Twitter and gaming links in the description below. I'll see you guys next time.